This only happens once in a lifetime. Don't procrastinate. Don't allow yourself to ruminate about your past. Don't be in your feelings. Put one foot in front of the other this year. Focus as soon as you get an idea, as soon as you get inspiration, make moves. you're living in your opportunity of a lifetime. What do I mean by this? First of all, let's be clear, there's always opportunities. Opportunities are not always something that is gonna come in the same form. Every day we have have an opportunity to be grateful for the most high, to have a great day, to get an idea, to have a lovely experience. There's always certain types of opportunities that are happening every day. But this type of once in a lifetime opportunity we're talking about is the opportunity to do something that takes you to a completely different level that sustains you not only in this life, but builds a legacy for those of you who you love that are here now and that will be coming afterwards. This is a opportunity to really solidify yourself. And for those of you, for whatever it is that you're doing, it's the perfect time. You have the perfect skills. You've been prepared for it. You're the perfect age. You're in the perfect stage of life. And again, you could be many different ages. It, this is not to say you have to be this age or that age. It, whatever age you are, whatever it is that you do, you are perfect for it now. This is the perfect time where you're gonna be able to build from a very solid foundation, something that is substantial, something that cannot be moved. Don't let anybody distract you from that. This is gonna be a year where it's very important to one, move in silence. Even if you have a partnership, even if you're married, you got best friends, I don't care who it is, move in silence this year. Keep your goals, keep your activities, keep a lot of those things to yourself. You will know when you're led to share something with somebody or get an opinion, an expert opinion from somebody who's able to give an expert opinion about a thing. But you're gonna get your most success by moving in silence, by sticking to your plan, by not letting anyone get you off of your routine, by making sure you work around it. Stick to your plan no matter what. Don't allow anybody or anything, no matter how good or opportunistic it may seem, to come in between what you're doing. Stick to your plan, don't let nobody get you off of it. I mean, stick to it like it's your life, like it's your bread and butter, because by being this way, first of all, you're gonna show the most high that you're actually ready. The opportunity and the blessings that are coming for you, you're gonna have to be able to stay with that. It's one thing to get blessed. It's one thing to have an opportunity, but how many people can keep it? How many people can have the stamina to stand the test of time? Many of you have been through the long, dark night of the soul. Many of you have been through the trials and tribulations. You are able to endure the persecution. You are able to learn how to continue to do what you do. And it gave you discipline to even when your life was falling apart, you were still able to show up. You still were able to be there for others during your worst times. Now that your head is above water and the Most High is giving you different things to do, the Most High is giving you strategy, the Most High is giving you structure, stick to it. This energy is going to be so necessary for where you're going. You're gonna have opportunities, I'm telling you, that are flowing into your life left and right. Many of you feel like you've been stagnant, stuck. Some of you months, some of you years, some of you a decade or more. And now all of a sudden, what you've been praying for, what you've been working towards, what you've been talking to the most high about, what you've been meditating on, all of those things that you've been asking for in so many different ways, now is the time that you're gonna receive it. But again, you have to do the work. Again, you got to show that you realize why you had to be disciplined, why you had to be able to do certain things in some of your worst moments, why you had to still show up every day, even though you was going through the wilderness, why you was going through the dark night of the soul, why you were losing everything. You still had to keep a straight face. You still had to show up. That's because the most high was building something solid inside of you. The most high was making you steadfast. The most high was giving you a type of discipline that now you was able to do that with a load on your back. Imagine now, the only thing that you gotta do is show up and it's gonna be light work for you because you're not even gonna have the same type of pressures of what you've been dealing with for the past seasons that you've been in. Show up, do not sacrifice yourself for anybody right now. You've already made enough sacrifices. This is not a time for you to sacrifice yourself in any type of way. And what I mean by sacrifice is take away from yourself or go against something that you have planned or something that you got in motion for the sake of somebody else's feelings. No. Okay, should we be considered? Absolutely. I'm talking to people who are naturally empathic. I'm talking to people who are children of the God. I'm not talking to narcissists. If you're a narcissist watching this, this video is not for you. Click skip on this one. Matter of fact, none of my videos on my channel are for you. Go watch the video about you were raised by a narcissist and learn how to do better. But for everybody else that I'm speaking to, the chosen ones, 
this is the type of advice that you need it ain't no more time to be making sacrifices you've made enough sacrifices this is a time to reap what you've sown this is a time for your, everything that you've done for the world and you've done for other people this is a time for you to do it for yourself the same way that you've been loyal and you were loyal to people who didn't even deserve your loyalty this is a time to be loyal to yourself to be loyal to your own objectives to be loyal to your own plans this is a time for you to stick to the path that the most High has put you on i guarantee you that anybody and everyone that is meant to be in your life is going to be able to sustain themselves around your boundaries, around your schedule. They're gonna be able to work with that. They're not gonna sacrifice that. They're not gonna have you sabotage not one thing. Come on Pretty Boss TV if you would like to book a personal with me. It's always an honor and a pleasure to be able to do those for y'all. We do got some reviews on the website. I love all of you who've left the review so far. I should have been putting out the review emails because we've done hundreds of personals so far um, since I started doing personals again. And also if you would like to join other chosen ones, what we doing the work and we're reminded to do the work daily. We stay in alignment over there on Patreon. We got the chats, family, we got a lot of fun stuff. I got a video right when you log on to Patreon that'll give you a whole rundown of what we're gonna be doing and what we've been doing moving into 2024. Patreon.com slash TV. All of my links are below. I love y'all so much. I hope that you had a happy love day if I post this after love day. This is love month though, so we're not done. And I, I hope that you like my sweetheart special fur. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I love y'all. Talk to y'all soon, y'all boy.